All right, guys, what's up? Back with another edition. Today we're going to another estate sale. This time it's in Beverly Hills, 90210. We're here. We're going to see what we can find. I had to set an appointment for this one. I had to set an appointment. So they, you had to call this number, then they'll give you an appointment time. It started today. I'm here at the first day. I made it the first day. It opened up at 11 a.m., all right? I'm scheduled at 3 o'clock. I'm about to go in right now see what I can find this one they wouldn't even give you the address and you had to schedule an appointment it's a mansion out here so we're gonna see what we can find hopefully we can get some good stuff I made it the first day so let's go in and see what we could get baby hopefully I find some good items I made it day one first day it's been like five hours since they opened I don't know how busy they are but hopefully they have some good items left um, yeah so some of them you have to call in and schedule an appointment and then they give you the address all right you can't just go all right i gotta go some nice clothing brands those up and they were 75 85 on the website um, these are, these the are hundred, some of them were 120 something but these are yeah. used though they're not they're yeah not they're used, used so. that's correct they are but used. they're still good though. but they're still that's very good this one, look at this. That's why I, this is about, this is one of those $150 I ones. Know, Michelle, I know. I mean, it's just, it takes the right buyer, it takes the right person. Yeah. Where? See it? There's. Estate sale 101. Okay. Six of those. So what's the deal? She said she will get for this. I'm sorry, four Everything's for sale. You want this? That's for sale too. It's a nice little pool right here. This is for sale. This is for sale. Everything. Let's see what's back here. This is a whole little Airbnb unit back here with a full kitchen. Damn. That's pretty tight. I don't know if they was doing that, but that's what I would be doing. You already got a mansion in front. You know what I'm saying? With the pool and a tennis court.
There's a lot of air going on in here. So, it's over. I didn't end up getting those pieces. It was too much. They were asking too much for that. Asking $20. I got them to go down $15 on the James t-shirts, but even I wanted to go to 10 because I can't get it up that much for the resale on those, those shirts. So they was trying to overcharge for those shirts. I ended up only getting one thing was this lacrosse polo shirt. Got that for $10. And then I got this little magazine. Hold your magazines and paperwork, folders or whatever, for 20 bucks. So that's all I ended up getting. We did have a deal at first, but then I looked it up and those wasn't selling for used price for the price that I needed to sell for. So to sell me $15 each, they only going for like 15, 20. So no, we can't do that deal. And the Ralph Lauren Polo purple label, those as well. Only a couple of them were going for a good enough price to buy those. She wanted 25 for those. So the deal didn't work out. She tried to go down lower on the price, but it didn't work out because as soon as I started taking stuff out of the pile because it wasn't going to work out, she so started like, well, well then I'm the, the regular price for all of them. Regular price. $30, it's $20. like, what? Well, $30 for that? I need to be selling those $10. So, whatever. It was a nice house, though. It was a nice house. The lady and husband, I guess, passed away. Um, it's on the market right now for $11 million. So whoever buys it is going to tear it down and build something way more modern and nicer. But this is definitely nice. It has a tennis court in the back and everything. So, man, yeah. So so you win some, you lose some. You know, I almost had a deal, but the price wasn't right. You try to go too high on those prices when they're used. Talking about this is a four hundred dollars, and it's not a four hundred dollar. Uh, once upon a time, it was four hundred dollars, but not anymore. And it's, it's used; it's not brand new. So you got to give a deal, all right? She didn't want to give a deal, so she didn't make the sale. Try to get me, but they didn't. All right. So lesson learned on that: don't rush on a on a purchase. Keep on doing your research to see how much those items are going for. And what's the best deal on the price that you're trying to negotiate? So, started at 30, I got it down to uh, 15, and then I needed it to be at 10, and she didn't want to go at 10, so forget it. All right. Till next time, man. Estate sales. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I mean, I got more videos like this coming up. Make sure you like comment subscribe if this helps somebody you know go ahead and share it as well all right more state sales more knowledge more tips and tricks are coming all right i'm out